Wouldn't it be something if the Heat's 23-game winning streak ended on the court where LeBron started his career in Cleveland? Speaking of the court, LeBron, an employee, noticing a leak coming down the floor. The mascot's got an umbrella, Dwayne Wade, and the rest of the players headed back to the locker room. That would be part of a 35-minute delay, but at tip-off, LeBron saying hello to the Cavs employees courtside. And LeBron had a slow first half, just six points on two of five shooting. Meanwhile, Tristan Thompson going off in the first quarter. Big slam, he had 10 in the first. Now the Cavs, Cavs with Cavs with, Cavs with Anderson Verge out, Deion Waiters in this one. Go on a run in the second. C.J. Miles had 10 points in the first half off the bench. And Tristan Thompson getting the short hook. Cavs close the half on a 22-3 run. Yes, they did actually lead by 21 at halftime. And the Cavs increasing their lead. Wayne Ellington had a team high 20. Tyler Zeller gets the lay-in and the foul. After the made free throw, Cleveland had a 27-point lead. But here come the Heat in the third. Shane Battier cuts it to 15. Battier missing the three, but Chris Bosh is there for the putback. It's a 10-point game. Now LeBron on the drive, using the window to cut it to nine. And then LeBron kicks it out to Ray Allen in transition for three. And just like that, it is 74-68. The Heat outscore the Cavs 34-22 in the third. And then the King takes over on the place he used to call home. Eight straight points to start the fourth quarter. That one missing, but he gets it right back and puts it in. 77-74, it's a two point game when LeBron gets the three to give the Heat a lead after a 40 to 12 run. LeBron to Allen one more time, Heat by four, as James had a triple-double, 25 points, 12 rebounds, and 10 assists. More from the Heat. Dwayne Wade, he had just 11 in this one, but that bucket puts Miami up by seven with under four to go. The Cavs, they have another life. Alonzo G on the slam, and it's 96-93. It's a one-point game after a couple of Thompson free throws. Wayne Ellington can't hit it. Ball goes out of bounds. Who is it out on, though? Check out this replay. This was awfully close, and the refs signaled that it is Miami's basketball. So the Heat by one with five seconds to go. They get it inbounds to LeBron, who is fouled. He goes to the line, hits the first, this the second, and that one is good as well. Miami by three. 4.7 to go. Cleveland with the ball and a chance to tie. C.J. Miles, good defense from Shane Battier, and the ball caroms off the rim, and the Cavs the biggest lead in a loss in franchise history. It was 27, but the Heat win their 24th straight by three, they're not just nine away from tying the 71-72 Lakers 33-game winning streak.